Do Ukrainian women like sexy guys? Absolutely, yes! Ukrainian women are looking for young, attractive, tall, smart, energetic men who are ready to create a family. And when you are young and energetic, there are many ways to attract your Ukrainian girlfriend and build a good, lasting connection with her. Um, for example, when we introduce you to one of our lady clients um, on a video. So, there is a first connection uh, when you are sharing who, more things than you see in each other's profiles and you are asking questions and you see that, wow, she's great, so I want to talk to her more. So you do. So what can you do? You are energetic, you are powerful, you want to show off, you want to make an impression. So what you can do is you can tell her compliments because in the communication between man and woman at the beginning it's all about her. It's all about how much you like her and chasing thing is traditional when you are willing to attract a woman from a traditional culture. So you are telling her compliments and you are also asking her questions that build trust. So what are the questions that build trust? Uh, Tell me more about your family and what about your parents and what do, what do they do and how much you are in contact with them. And then tell her the same answers about you. Uh, tell her about your plans. Uh, show her some of the um, ideas that you uh, want in the future. Um, tell her different important things in your life. Talk about values. And while you are doing all that, um, Make different video dates. Um, make videos from places that are dear to you. Um, we have internet all over the world, 5G even available, wherever you go. So find places that show you from the best angle possible. So uh, the point is showing yourself in the best light possible. So. Um, communicating to woman, asking about her questions, um, telling her serious, deep thing, things about yourself. Um, it's about your intellect, right? And you can even send her roses or whatever flowers you like to make an impression. But some guys are taking the heavy weapon from like the first couple of days of communication, boom, boom, an explosion, and she receives a picture of his naked torso. Can you imagine that? Oh my God. You are introduced by a serious matchmaker who is supporting traditional family values. Um, you are in this space where um, people are talking about serious things, creating family, and you, you use such an ace of a card to show yourself off? Seriously? Well, this is the number one fastest recipe to lose a girl. Because how the girl feels is like disgust, like, is he nuts? What does he want to show me? Like, yeah, he's got beautiful bodies, so what? Is he that desperate? Is, it, is he that, like, unable to control himself? Does he want to, to, to give me a message that now I have to send him something else? What does he want me to send him? And all these things running in the girl's head thinking, oh my God, like, this is a reputable agency. Uh, and that's how guys allow themselves to behave, right? So you're not only ruining my reputation by using such ace cards of yourself, but you're also making the woman feel disgust, disappointed, and turn her off. In the, the purpose was turning her on, right? Uh, and... <laughs> <laughs> you receive, achieve an absolutely opposite effect. And, well, sexting is not about uh, intellect or serious intentions. Do you agree? 
Well, if you disagree, please write me in the comments to this video. Uh, but I will tell you when it is appropriate. For example, people do that a lot. Actually, when they meet on dating apps, when they meet personally and uh, then continue their communication because they know each other well and they want to add a lot of fun to this. That's good. But they should meet each other. They should like each other. After sex, sexting is an awesome thing. But before you met a person, before you build con contact with her, before you trust her, you are really not putting yourself in, in a decent light at all. And uh, people in the same culture are sexting a lot, even not knowing each other, because in some countries it is considered like masculine, like cool, like mm, attracting somebody, right? If you belong to those countries, please write me more about sexting and how it works. Because I hear from some of the male clients, from young male clients, that it's actually cool uh, to start bombing girl with pictures of your body or parts of the body. Frankly speaking, I receive sometimes pictures of body parts from, like, so to say, men who are looking for a wife and I blog those. It, it makes me feel sad, but I understand the modern world. We, we have to be ready for anything. It's, it's like open internet, so you can receive anything you may. But my goal is to protect women and to help women focus on the right guys, on the serious guys, and on not those who will be sexting to them before they meet each other. And um, helping people really understand uh, how to move step by step. Because, well, um, sex is a big connector between the humans. But it has to be appropriate and you have to use it to your advantage. So, when I'm introducing you to a lady, then uh, you ask each other questions, then you deepen your communication uh, and you want to meet in person. So, in order to meet in person, you need to feel good about meeting this person. You need to feel that you can trust this girl, she can trust this man, uh, he is an absolutely adequate person, he's safe to be around, he's asking safe questions, he's showing me his space, he is uh, talking about serious things, he's got mom and dad, or he grew up alone without mom and dad, or whatever, whatever, whatever is about your life. Uh, and then she feels confident about your communication. And then there comes time uh, to meet personally. But then talk to her about meeting personally. Uh, have two hotel rooms and give her space. Because in our culture, if a man is serious about you, he will give you space and he will let uh, the, the fun, the, the energy between you appear naturally. Uh, I'm talking about Ukrainian men who are taking you as relationship material, as family material. Because, mm, you know, sending <laughs> a text, uh, sexy text message and sexting before you met in person uh, is like having sex on the first day, right? Well, does it lead to family? <laughs> In very rare cases. And does it bring some fun? Yes, that's all it's, it's about. So, um, when you have met in person, when you when you were able to open yourself emotionally uh, with a lady, when you um, started from from nice touches to to, to more and more and more. Uh, and then when you finally enjoy the, the sexual pleasures with each other, then it is okay to, to exchange those kind of messages uh, when you don't meet each other because you need to keep the fire. Uh, and that works and that actually brings people together because they are open with each other. This is the only circumstance uh, when sexting is talking about your love and not about your lust. Uh, but um, otherwise, you know, you are at a big risk uh, to, to lose a decent girl because a decent girl in Ukraine looks at it like this. 
The guy is confident about himself. He doesn't have to show his body parts to attract her. He would rather attract her with his goals, with his personality, with his confidence, with his life achievements, with his attention to her, with his willing to get to know her better. And they believe that a decent guy knows how to flirt the right way and is confident that, you know, when they are together, he will touch her hand and she will feel the chills because he knows how to touch, not by grabbing her, not by doing something inappropriate, but by putting himself in an elegant, um, confident way. So, if you like this video, of course, put likes and write your comments. But if you want to know more about Ukrainian women, I invite you to my personal consultation or meet one of my matchmakers and talk to us about helping you meet serious family-oriented Ukrainian women. They are all over the world right now. And we have changed our operations, as you can hear. We introduce people online now, and then they meet personally. And we help everybody in this process. The ladies, the guys, we give them ideas on how to be appropriate and how to build trust. And watching my videos will definitely help you. So scroll more, watch more videos, put more likes, and if you need personal help in finding a Ukrainian girlfriend, then talk to us and we will do.